Sammy! What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy are. Come on. All right, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. place we used to have a spirit board. A what? Wow, you have a spirit board? Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well... Hey, Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um, okay, guess so. Brad, I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over, you know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... Uh, what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. I'll, look, I'll be honest. It's definitely weird being back here, but... I think it'll help us all put everything behind us. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, watch your step. 
I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Sorry to drag you down into the bowels. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, Dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. New reality, right, Sam? Anyway. I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right? Here, can you can you hold this? What's that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Hey, can you just keep the light so I can see, okay? Nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mmm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Just try again. Oh. That's more like it. <laughs> All right. Five, girl. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. You were totally freaked out too. What? <laughs> You're no. as white as a sheet. No, no, come on. I've been I've been down here enough. This place makes all kinds of sounds. I mean, big old lodge has gotta belch out sometimes. Wait, okay, so you hear that too, right? Josh. What? Regular. Not, not, nothing regular about it. Maybe we should check it out. Why? I don't know. What if it's like a, a pipe that's about to burst or some problem with the furnace? Unlikely. If it were me, 
I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you... are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master! Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank. Which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not! Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh! What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm -hmm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. I would like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? How do you feel about people who are afraid? I see, well, Mike has a fear of isolation. Do you feel pity for him? This is not reflected in the way you are playing your game now, is it? And now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? <sighs> so you would tell a lie in order to be loyal to a friend, okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? So you would sooner look after your friends before caring for those in greater need? Oh, well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon.